Hey, welcome to Draft Academy. My name is Mike. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install Jekyll on Mac. In order to install Jekyll, we're actually going to need two other programs. The first program is called Ruby, and Ruby is a programming language, and it's actually the language that Jekyll was written in. And therefore, we need Ruby on our computer so Jekyll can run and so we can build and maintain our website. The other program we're going to need is called Ruby Gems, and Ruby Gems is a package manager for Ruby. And a package manager is basically just a program that lets us download, install, and maintain other programs on our computer. And Ruby Gems is a package manager for Ruby, so therefore it's going to allow us to use, up, install, update, and maintain Ruby programs. And in this case, we're going to use it to install Jekyll. Now the good news for Mac users is that Macs come pre-installed with Ruby and Ruby Gems right off the bat. So the first thing that I want to do is head over to my terminal. And the terminal is basically just a program on our Mac which we can use to access Ruby Gems and Ruby. The first thing I want to do is just check to make sure that we have the correct version of Ruby installed. So I'm just going to type Ruby hyphen version. Actually, we can just type hyphen V. And this will spit out a Ruby version. So in my case, I have Ruby 2.4.2. Now, you're gonna need a Ruby version 2.1 or higher to install and use Jekyll. Next thing I wanna do is check to make sure we have the correct version of gems or just to make sure that we have gems installed on our computer. So I'm just gonna type gem hyphen V and this will spit out the current version of gem that we have on our computer. So as long as you have Ruby installed and you have gem installed, then we can actually just go ahead and install Jekyll. So what I want to do is type gem install Jekyll bundler. And basically we're asking this package manager, we're asking gem to go out and install Jekyll onto our computer. So I'm just gonna click enter and this will go off and do its thing and grab everything that we need to install Jekyll on our Mac. So you can see here the installation has finished and we have two gems installed. Now all we have to do is just validate that this got installed. So I'm just gonna type Jekyll hyphen V and this should spit out the current version of Jekyll. So in my case, it's 3.6.0. Once you've done that and you were able to install Jekyll, then you're done and you have everything you need on your Mac to start building a website. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to Draft Academy to be the first to know when we release new content. Also, we're always looking to improve, so if you have any constructive criticism or questions or anything, leave a comment below. Finally, if you're enjoying Draft Academy and you want to help us grow, head over to draftacademy.com forward slash contribute and invest in our future.